students at Ogden Elementary cheer for their favorites as classmates race solar-powered boats down a water-filled track. The kids built these boats themselves using water bottles and more. What we had was a solar panel and a motor and a, and a rudder uh, right here. It like uh, forms electricity through the solar panel and the solar panel uh, uses the electricity for uh, whatever you're going to use it for. As you heard, students are learning about solar power. Our next generation is our hope to help us meet some of the biggest energy challenges we have. So we're pretty excited that um, schools want to participate and include this information in STEM curriculum. The Bonneville Environmental Foundation facilitated this project with teachers and representatives were on hand to see the boats in action. As a program director I'm usually doing lots of administrative stuff, you know, like budgets and things, so I love seeing this sort of thing. You know, uh, Math, science, excitement, um, all involved in this, this process. So. Beyond solar power, students also learned a fundamental concept of engineering, trial and error. It was amazing to see, um, well what if we change the rudder size, or what if um, um, uh, sometimes they wanted to bring the airboat a little bit closer down while well, the propeller hit, so that didn't work. So. If we didn't put a lot of water it would tilt side to side, and so if we put it, um, a little bit of water it would stay balanced uh, and it would go straight. We really um, had to keep constructing this, keep making it better and finding solutions. And in the end, sink or float, win or lose, students ventured into new waters. It, it feels good. Inside Vancouver Public Schools, I'm Tara Cox.